Hi everyone. In this last video of the series, I'll be showing you my modifications to a cheap but decent laser engraver from eBay. I have included a link to the software I made to control the laser power much easier and more precise. I am not a developer, and I got this working enough for me. I hope it works for you, but I won't be able to help if it doesn't. I replace the laser fire and potentiometer with an Arduino Uno connected to the laser power supply, all controlled with a Python app on my computer. I left the controller board that came with the engraver as the included software works very well for this application. I used a rocker switch so that the laser will only arm if the lid is down, ensuring I don't accidentally fire the laser while unprotected. I replaced the original bed and cut the fan duct back to utilize the full engraving area. It is not needed for this application, but I thought it would be useful for larger cells. The original controller plate was replaced with one I 3D printed to hold the power switch and digital power display. The captain or polyamide film is taped flat to a plate of glass. Since the laser is essentially melting the surface, the film will want to curl. I am making six 4x4 four four centimeter electrodes, which takes a little over 25 minutes to finish. For this video, I'm going to use both sides of the film. I should make a jig for precision, but I will just have to eye it for now. I was a little off as expected, but both sides look really good. I will try them out and possibly make another video of the tests. Thanks for watching.